Greetings commanders, I'm Cyber Settler and today we are making a mission with uh, an anaconda. So I recently bought this ship and I wanted to test it and uh, yeah I have a mission where uh, I have to deliver some medicines, uh, I mean the colonia system. Uh, we are well, th this this ship, the Anaconda. My first impression is that it's uh, big and heavy. Uh, it has a lot of hard points, so that's good uh, for combat. And uh, of course, it, it has uh, a lot of space for cargo, so it can complete uh, several missions in one go. And this is what I'm doing now. I'm comp I, I have taken two missions uh, to deliver cargo. In total, it's 240 tons I have with me. So, the mission, let's see first. What's the, the jump range that I I'm currently have? Okay, currently I have 10 light years of jump range that's not much I have also I have equipped I can show what what's currently equipped I have a fighter hangar one thing about um, the hangar in the anaconda is that you can fit two fighters in one hangar so but only it accepts one additional NPC crew so I think the only thing you can do is uh, if you're playing alone uh, you can send one crew with one fighter and you either you go in another fighter or you stay in the mothership mm, so I I'm not sure what is the best thing to do uh, my first thought is uh, the best thing is to stay in the mothership. Uh, what else? What's the? I'm I'm thinking about what's the advantage of this uh, uh, of the anaconda. Of course, it has a. If you, you can um, outfit it in such a way that it has a larger jumping range than other ships. I think it has uh, one of the I think it it's is the ship that can achieve the longest uh, jumping range and also it can uh, load a lot of cargo but the disadvantage is that it uses a large landing pad and you cannot use this uh, it can be a headache this 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 the fact that it cannot land but in a large landing pad of course if you are using it for exploration or for certain missions between uh, big stations that's fine um, if you're using it for combat well I think it can be a, 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 a powerful ship as well but the driving is uh, for me it's I don't know I, I prefer the crate to be honest in in that sense I think that the crate has a good ratio between uh, the the cargo it can hold and um, the size of the ship it can land on medium pads you have to sometimes or frequently you have to wait uh, to land in uh, small stations but you always you can always land in any station okay so let's go uh, um, I have to first set the destination destination was the the resource system that is right here but I think I cannot get there nope I have to jump make two jumps so probably have to go here 10 or 8 yes let's go here to be sure 
so let's launch it I was testing this ship and I was trying to dock in the Jake's station and it's impossible this Jake station I mean the open and, it, and this Jake station is always crowded I really don't know what's going on in the jet station. Look at these guys, it's so... <laughs> it's huge, I feel how heavy this uh, ship is. Also the... The exit... Is a little bit... Um, yes, tight. Wow, wow, wow. The mailbox... <laughs> This is how they call it, right? Oops. Okay, I think that was because I took too long to exit. It's like, uh, I don't know, driving a truck or something. <laughs> and it's not so fast. You, you see here that it's uh, 180 the, the 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 top speed and i and i have all the power in the engines you see here because if i distribute the the power now it's reducing to 150 40 something wow okay it's it's slow okay let's go 130 is the speed. You've now exceeded the no fire zone. Goodbye, Commander. So let's see if we can complete this mission. And let's see if they don't send uh, pirates or bounty hunters, whatever. And I don't know if we should fight them. Well, I usually don't engage in fights. But since this is a review, it could... I don't know if I should do it. I'm risking <laughs> the two missions with cargo and uh, the cargo is from the mission. So I will have to pay a penalty if I don't deliver the, the goods. So let's make the next jump. You can see this is a really big um, bridge. And I wonder. <laughs> It, it, it could be nice when we have a space legs to, to go around the anaconda. I wonder how it will be like. There's like this uh, strange... This... Uh, I don't know, like this viewing port at the front. Oh. I think that means that we are being followed. Yep. Yeah, I knew it. Okay, guys, so we are being followed. I think um, I should test. I should test fighting. It think no, yes. This is Let's see. No, this is what I've got. Multi cannons and pulse lasers. And let's put the uh, shields up. Let's see how it performs fighting. I I don't know. Uh, 
And I have, yes. I think I have the crew, right? Yes, I have two crew. But I think I can only de deploy one of them. Let's see, okay. Let's submit. And let's send the first one. Deploy. Engage at will. The other, I don't know if I can deploy it. No, I cannot deploy it. So, okay, where is the... They're fighting far away. Okay, I don't know if the ship is too slow to get to there. Wow. It's a little bit puny. These weapons. I think I have something incorrectly. Yeah, the heat sink, probably. And the cannons, they're not firing. Okay, I think I. <laughs> I didn't set up this correctly. I have these puny pulse lasers. Uh, probably I have the cannons with the left, with the right, the left. I don't know what I did there. Yes. I set it up the wrong thing. Scanner, but why? Okay, let me... Mm-hmm. Okay, yes, let me try to help the, my crew, but with this setting I cannot. This one, right? Yeah. Here I'm, I f uh, I'm at full speed, but I cannot. Well, maybe if I give more energy to the... Yeah, there we go. Oh, they, we are getting some reinforcement. But why doesn't... It's not... Why is not firing? Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know what I did. It's messed up. Oh, if I could. I have this really bad. It's destroyed. Okay, well, he did it. 
Well, this fighter really uh, the. The fighter uh, helps a lot. Returning the ship for recovery, Commander. But I, I don't know what I'm doing with the fire groups. They're a mess. This is all messed up. I don't know why. Okay, this is the way it should work. Point defense laser. Clear to shut down telepresence. No, but look at this. It's, it's not okay. Whatever. I don't know. I still is in like the wrong setting. Okay, let's complete the mission. But that was uh, relatively easy. Sometimes I get really hard uh, enemies and I cannot get rid of them. And one thing that happened was that I had to to jump to hyperspace while, while the fighter was uh, engaged because it's, it was like frying my ship. It has like this uh, heat beam and I have to jump into hyperspace and what happens then is that the fighter is destroyed when you if you jump uh, to hyperspace while the fighter is deployed but this doesn't uh, kill the crew or something that the, the crew returns to the ship immediately Okay, another enemy. I wonder how is this going to deploy? Copy that. Establish telepresence. Okay, I have my puny <laughs> weapons. Oh, guys, I promise I will. Let's see if I... The cannons. Or is it? For some reason they don't fire, I don't know why. Ah no, I think I was doing it wrong. I have to, uh, I have to... I have to keep the keep the trigger pressed. Okay, we're doing a lot of damage. I think he doesn't stand a chance.
Come on, fire! What is it? Too far. Ah! I ran out of energy for the... Okay, we have him almost destroyed. He wants to run away. Come on, let's destroy him. He's almost... There you go. Okay, the cannons are not bad. Okay, so there are more ships, it seems. Let's recall our ship. So we access here orders. Recall fighter. Returning the ship for recovery, commander. Okay, that's not bad. I think we have been lucky until now. But I think there's still one ship, one uh, bounty hunter behind us. Okay, it's let's go. We should have perhaps someone behind us next. Let's see, because we're really close now. I think he won't be able to catch us now. Okay, so we are at our destination now let's see if we find a spot well I have Ah, maybe what happens I don't know if it's maybe it's the the power of the of the weapons that they don't or no uh, it's is the wrong configuration here oh I don't know okay.
I I I wanted it to to be like uh, we have all the web all these weapons in the same group, but I don't know. I did something wrong. Okay, let's request. Permission authorized. Proceed to bay zero nine. Well, that's good. We have a place assigned. So this is one of the things I worry about with this ship. So hopefully we will be there soon. Ah, this orientation is not good. Let's go closer. There we go. Also the visibility of the of the of this cockpit I don't like it very much. I in that sense I prefer the the crate. It has a good visibility. Really good visibility. Okay, so someone is What is he doing? Okay, now the challenge to get into this mailbox. Wow, there you go. Where is it here? So we are almost there. So guys, we are almost done with the missions I would like to take this view there There we go. It's huge this ship, isn't it? But we we did it. Well, we are successful. We landed safely and this is this is the 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 front um I don't know how to call this 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 is like a having some sort of uh, viewing port and this is uh, a mystery I don't know what what is this and in the sides it has like this um, also these corridors Unlawful behavior in and around the starport is not permitted we thank commanders for their cooperation I wonder what is that for the ship is huge Okay, but I still think that the crowd is better. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. So, 
I hope you enjoyed the video and if so hit the like button and hopefully we'll see each other in the next video. This is Cyber Settler signing off.